Good morning folks, this is day 6 of our spring bear hunt. Today we have a special guest, Jamie. She has decided to come out with us today. So we'll have an extra pair of eyes. Uh, this is back up where I saw the bear the other day. Uh, we're actually on our way up there right now and uh, we're just slowly glassing. And, uh, working our way out this draw but yeah it's a nice day uh, hopefully hopefully we spot something it is Cinco de Mayo so happy birthday to my dad and uh yeah hopefully we spot something hopefully we shoot one and uh should be fun I have an extra packer with me so not too worried if I shoot one then she'll get a good workout but <laughs> yeah we will see you guys up there We are back up at my classing point. I've been here for about 10 minutes or so. Just had a snack. Uh, we've seen about eight does this morning. We'll class them up. We'll class most of them up. And we saw a few just hanging out. And then seen turkey. And that's about it. No bears, nothing else. It's supposed to be in the 70s today. So. Might, I mean, probably up here, probably be in the mid 60s, but it's very sunny, uh, kind of breezy up here because we're pretty high up. But yeah, hopefully, we'll catch one on the move, and uh, hopefully, we'll find it in a spot that is stockable and killable. So that's just the plan for the day. See our uh, special guest glassing really hard. So, mm -hmm. yeah, oh I'll get back behind the glass and just hope that we find something today. Okay, you can't really see it on film, but down. Right in there is a bear. Daniel's gonna try and go for it. Yeah, that's a big bear. A big one will let you move the ball.
about a 2.1 right now. I think you nailed him. He rolled. Did it? Yeah. But I swear it looked like you hit him. You can stop that. Oh shit. I can't see him right now. I saw it roll. We'll have to watch the fudge. I just shot a freaking bear. I don't know, it looked like I hit it and it rolled, but it is a freaking bruiser. She spotted it. I was, we were over there. I was actually glassing back over there and she walked in front of me and he was wide in the open. She's like, she's like, babe, bear. I was like, no way. And then I walked over and I just see this big, huge black glob. It is a freaking big bear. And I never spot anything first. Good job, babe. Fingers crossed. He's just straight down. I look like it looked like right when I shot, it just rolled. But it looked like a good shot. But we'll find out. 400 yards. We, where we were first spotted him, it was 500. But I knew he wasn't gonna hear us or see us, so we booked it down here. 400 <laughs> yards. We're gonna. Keep an eye out. I'm gonna watch the footage real quick, see if it rolled or not. But if it, I was stable, I dialed it, dialed for wind. I brought my my wind meter today because like it's the wind's been breezy up here, so I brought that. Freaking doped it. That shot felt it felt good. But or I'm gonna watch the footage real quick just to make sure it rolled. Because no death, no nothing. It just disappeared. To me, it looked like you dumped him. So. Why don't you be the judge? I don't see anything moving. We're going to look at the footage real quick, and then we'll get back to you guys. I am super pumped. I had a good feeling about today, and freaking Jamie with the spot. What time is it? It's like 1 or 2 in the afternoon. It's 3 o'clock in the afternoon. Exactly. Oh, my God. All right, so we reviewed the footage and it looked like a great shot. Uh, we're trying to find a way down there now. Uh, we're on a super steep, this is like, what is it called? What? Deadfall, not deadfall. Logged area? Yeah, it was like a new log, growth? log area with a bunch of new growth. I guess that's all we'll call it. But there's like logs everywhere and it's, Freaking steep. This part should be okay ish. Yeah, we'll just go down here. But we're gonna. Yeah, we're gonna go down, we're gonna drop down, and then we're gonna hike up. Uh, we haven't seen anything come out from after he rolled. Uh, you guys will see it on the shot. I've recorded it with uh, the phone scope on the Razer HD, and the footage was pretty good. So. We're gonna drop down, we're gonna hike across the creek, and then we're gonna go try to find him. Uh, it looks like a really nice bear. It's, it's just black. It's just, there was no way we could have missed it. But yeah, uh, I mean, we've celebrated already, but like I told Jamie, like, you know, sometimes it looks like a great shot, but sometimes they don't die, so who knows. We're gonna go there, we're gonna go look for it. Well, I'm gonna go look for it. I don't want her to go with me once we get over there just in case 
it's not dead and I have to shoot it again so I'm trying to be safe and uh yeah we will update you guys when we get over there I am excited but it, yeah I have no words I don't even know what to say anymore <laughs> we'll see you guys over there boy was that a roller coaster just hike down you'll see me so what a roller coaster man we came up and above came down to where we shot him no blood nothing my heart just kind of my stomach just kind of sunk it was just I was just like you know what this is gonna suck because no blood there was no blood there was there was nothing there was no sign of anything because right when I hit him it rolled so I looked for blood all around the area I couldn't find anything just keep walking down and uh I didn't want to go into the thick stuff without finding blood so I looked and looked and didn't really it came down to you know I gotta go down into stick stuff so I dropped off my bag had Jamie sit up there and I cut over and I finally spotted it what a freaking rush they look so big from far away that's why they say bears are so hard to judge it's decent it's an average sized bear but I didn't catch blood until right when I already spotted before I even found the blood trail and freaking thank the Lord I am so happy uh, everything came together I've been hunting hard day six of hunting for me and uh, after today I would have covered over 50 miles on foot so yeah Jamie's on her way down and we'll let you guys look at the bear I'm sure you guys want to look at it so yeah let me uh, I'm gonna pull it out and then we'll show you guys <laughs> All right, guys. Well, there he is. Uh, we pulled him out. We took some pictures, and uh, we got him uh, set up for uh, <clears throat> some decent pictures. It's super steep, and it's super nasty here, so we didn't really have much option. But yep, I don't know if I said it was a sow earlier. We checked, and it is a boar. Uh, when I when we first spotted it, I thought for sure it was a boar just by the way it's. No, I thought it was a boar when oh, we first saw. Yeah, I knew for a fact right when uh i put the glass up that just the posture mm -hmm. of it the way it acted i could tell that it was a boar and uh earlier it had poop covering up his junk and i didn't want to touch it so i just kind of assumed it was a sow but it is a boar so that's a plus uh this time of the year we just try to avoid shooting sows you know they may be they may have cubs or maybe cubless but uh, we just try to target uh boars in the it is a boar, so that's awesome. Uh, you know, thank God for this day, for this opportunity, uh, for you know, just you know, providing us this you know opportunity. Now we have meat. Uh, we do enjoy eating meat. Jamie loves eating it, so that's a it's a good thing. And uh, thank to Jamie. Thanks to Jamie for coming out with me. Uh, I was I've been hunting alone, and uh, you know, it's good to hunt alone, but it gets boring after a while, and. Uh, for sure I'm super happy that I have somebody here to help me pack this thing out. I mean it's not as big as the one I shot in 2016 but it's an average size bear. I'd say about 175, 180 poundish. So really nice coat on it as well. Uh, unfortunately we're probably just going to leave it. We got a far ways to the uh, to the truck and uh, we still got a uh, taxidermy bill on the, the cougar hide. So. <laughs> I don't think we're gonna have room for this so yeah thank you guys for watching thank you guys for f that's uh, the guys that's been following along on this series uh, you know I just it was it would have been a long series if I hunted all the way till the end of the season but you know we were blessed with this boar and uh, we made a good shot we made and, you know everything just planned out in our favor and uh, we got the job done so very happy for that and uh, yeah now we're gonna cord it up and <laughs> we're gonna hike it out of here it's gonna be a long hike it's about five o'clock right now so we got about three hours of light and uh yeah again thank you guys for watching uh hit that subscribe button if you haven't and uh we will see you guys on the way out <laughs>